Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Elhamdülillah ve salatu ve selamu ala Resulillah ve ala alihi ve sahbihi ve sellem ecma'in. Allahümme enfa'ni bima allemteni ve allemni bima yunfa'ni ve zidni elmen inneke l'alimul hakim. My topic today is representing a case of young female patient has a liver lesion and we want to characterize that lesion on MRI. And the lesion is hepatic adenoma. Here we have the in phase image, and this is out phase image, and this is T2. As we see here, there is in the in phase image, we have a slightly high ball intense mass lesion compared to the rest of the devolv here. And on the out phase image, and some of areas of the high ball intense area of the mass become more high ball intense and develop in its signal. And this is indicating that there is a microscopic fat. And here the lesion is also seen in the T2 and uh, roughly it is looks like iso intense or slightly hypo intense to the liver tissue to the rest of the liver tissue if we want to characterize the lesion we want to give the patient contrast and we will take the contrast in the arterial and both of venous and delete. Here, after administration of the contrast me media, this is the arterial phase, and this is the bottle venous phase, and this is the delayed phase after 60 minutes. It is a hepatocellular to see the delay execution phase. As we see here, the, in the arterial phase, the lesion is hypervascular and become iso intense on the bottom venous phase. And in the biliary execution phase about 60 minutes after the contrast injection there is no return of contrast material in the lesion and the rest of the liver become retained return contrast due to biliary execution and the the region is hypervascular and contain fat and there is no return of contrast material in a biliary excretion phase so the region is typical for hepatic adenoma MRI is the technique of choice for characterization of the region as we said the main differential of the this lesion is focal nodular hyperplasia is the main differential as we said we use the uh, mri contrast agent with biliary excretion we have two types of contrast material with biliary excretion the first one is Duglomine gadobidinate, and the other one is gadoxytic acid. The difference between them, the first one is it is have biliary excretion in 
small amount and we take the delayed image after about 60 to 90 minutes from the injection. And then the second one has 50% uh, biliary excretion and we will take the Im delayed image in about 20 minutes. And we see if the lesion retain contrast material or not not retaining contrast material. If retain contrast material, so this is the typical of focal nodular hyperplasia. And if it is not retained, it is adenoma. We have about 10 to 20 percent of focal nodular hyperplasia has a typical feature, and we can classify it as a non-classic focal nodular hyperplasia and they present a diagnostic challenge at the imaging. As they may show typical of adenoma in different degrees. Thank you for listening and hoping to see you in another talk soon.